who is the strongest Avenger in your opinion? Who do you think will win in a fight if everyone fought? Would uh, it be you? Would it be Thor? Would it be? Uh, well, I mean, I, I, uh, I'm biased. But I, you have awesome powers. I have really, really good powers. I don't know why Ant Man, when I was a boy, wasn't as popular as the other ones because Ant Man had awesome fucking powers. When I was when I was filming Ant Man for the first time, there was a moment when I got to hang out a little bit with Stan Lee. Yes, I was going to ask. And you. this was the coolest day ever. And we were sitting. It was the day that he came in to shoot his cameo, and we were sitting by the monitors. And he said, "I'm so happy that they're making Ant Man into a film." And uh, he said, the reason is, I always had this vision uh, of Ant-Man. And every time you would read about him in the comic book, you could never really gauge the size. It just doesn't work with panels in a, co in a comic book. You can't tell how small he you is. Can't ha you don't have anything there's that's no going, reference. There's no reference. Right. And so he said, with a movie, you really will be able to see the way I envisioned it, which I've never really seen envisioned in the way that I kind of imagined. I love this behind the scenes stuff. You, um, on, uh, tell me if it's true on Avengers, you got a hold of uh, Captain America's shield. In other words, he hands it to the PA or somebody. <laughs> right. And you say, hey, PA, give me that fucking shield. Yeah. I'm going to hold it. Yeah. You were shocked it was heavier than you thought. It's heavy. You yeah. Be strong yeah. to play. Well, it's, 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 it, yeah. Yeah. It, um, I it is you. impossible. <laughs> to not be kind of caught up in all of yeah all of the stuff i mean i rem we were shooting endgame and, and and it's like wow there's the gauntlet yeah and uh or there's thor's hammer you it's, get genuinely excited inc yes i would too i i mean all of the memorabilia all of the stuff all of this stuff that i know is like it, it kind of ingrained in people's conscience is there a problem when you're filming a, a an iconic thing like that where you go, shit, maybe I should grab something. Maybe I should take uh, my, uh, my hand. I just assume, or... I, I assume they're just monitoring everything. You, they do. And I can't, words, you can't yeah, take that It home. would be real, it would be a real bad move to try and pocket a shield. <laughs> Not pocket, but would you be a <laughs> douchebag if you went up to them and said, oh, can I keep my Ant-Man boots? Uh, I've done it. Boots? Oh, I did, did it. What do yeah. you have? I have an Ant-Man helmet. Are you shocked when you see yourself in those movies? Because I would imagine there's so much green screen special effects and everything. In a way... Of course, you're a probably half the shit you shoot. You're imagining. You see it for the first time when you see the movie. Sometimes, like right. that end game, that you know that whole sequence. It was like, oh my god! So this is what it looks like, and you you do kind of have to imagine certain things. But there's also and it's amazing. It's what they incredible. Do. I yeah. mean, they've got really talented people doing. Are you talking about effects. where people start disappearing and stuff? With all start, of this yeah, stuff, yeah, yeah. yeah. Wow. It, it was really, um, it's, it's cool to see. It's cool to see because, you know, you work on something, but it's still nice when you see the movie to be surprised.